Charles defies the Queen with the latest message. Prince Charles has reportedly been instructed by the firm to end his climate change activism when he eventually takes the throne. But on Monday, the 71-year-old showed no sign of stopping his sustainable efforts, with the Duke issuing a stark warning of looming disaster. Speaking from his Birkhall home on the Bomoro Estate in Aberdeenshire, Scotland, the Prince of Wales delivered a keynote speech to mark the start of Climate Week NYC. With us with an immediate action, at an unprecedented pace and scale, we will miss the window of opportunity to reset for a more sustainable and inclusive future, Charles began. He continued, The environmental crisis has been with us for far too many years, decried, denigrated, and denied. It is now becoming a comprehensive catastrophe that will drop the impact of the coronavirus pandemic. The global pandemic is a wake-up call we simply cannot afford to ignore, he added. Clan House also shared the video to its Instagram, writing, The Prince of Wales has delivered a virtual keynote speech to launch the start of Climate Week NYC. Running coordination with the UN, Climate Week brings together international figures from the private, public, and philanthropic sectors to discuss climate action, the message stated. The lengthy message then went on to explain that in June, Prince Charles' Sustainable Markets Initiative SMI, and World Economic Forum launched the Great Reset. The global initiative encourages us to build back better through the rebuilt, redesign, reinvigoration, and rebalance of our world in the wake of COVID-19, the, messages, the message added. Charles' contribution at Climate Week comes after he was criticized in July and reportedly told he may be forced to give up his activism when he eventually ascends to the throne. Speaking to Express at the time, Royal Commentator Richard Fitzwilliams said the Duke may encounter resistance from the firm should he want to pursue such activism moving forward. The Prince began his campaign years ago. He's been campaigning for over half a century on the environment, Richard told the British publication. The commentator went on to say that while people initially didn't take Charles seriously, he has kept up his sustainable ventures, so there's a chance he will continue to advocate it. But remember, it isn't a party political issues, it is something that almost all governments in the world now support, that is the reduction of carbon emissions. So the prince wouldn't be straying into controversial territory by mentioning it, he said.